And so Brightwork Power Pack BI is already pre-built. So um, working on the Power BI platform um, it is a result of our mission to offer interactive dashboards. Um, and then we'll be able to drill down into that information. Um, it will be downloadable and connects to your Brightwork Enterprise data. It's basically connecting to the project cache, the work cache, and the project status report cache. And then another thing Scott mentioned was status reports. So right here we're showing you the latest status report that was put in for each project. And so I am grouping this so that we can see by the latest period ending. So Scott just put in his um, hardware upgrade global project report for week ending of this week. We see that the health of the project is yellow, the time is green, and the issues are red. And then what the percent complete is and what those comments are that he's actually putting in his status report. So we can see all that information here just quickly in um, one view. Let's say that maybe I just want to see projects that the health is in warning because, of course, this will be very long as you guys start using the reports. So maybe I just want to pull those out that are actually showing me the health is yellow or if they're red, that actually will be an option as well. And so I can come in here and just filter those out so I can see them quickly. Another one is two is by status. So this is the time. So if I want to see the ones that are here on target, we can see that. But then we also see that we have one here that's in danger, which means it's red. So, of course, again, this list would be very long. I can then quickly come in and actually show me just the ones that are in danger. And then the same thing for the issues, for the issue status, which these are all using our indicators that are in our project metrics on our um, project sites. So these should be configured for your environment of when they turn red, yellow, green, or you could be using our out of the box. Maybe I just want to see by a particular project. Again, I have that option as well to see by just a particular project how my project is doing. Of course, as we add more status reports, then we would see the more status reports for that one project.